back now, 7.30 on this uh, Friday morning. I'll turn along with Katie Kirk, Al Roker, I'm Brian Gumbel. Um, one week ago today, uh, Gene Shallot was down in Florida. He'd gone down to do some spring training pieces, and ever a guy to try to find a, a way out of work. Um, Gene, <laughs> Gene managed to wander out into the street and get himself hit by a car. Um, broken leg resulted, broken in several places, mm. but he is resting well, successful surgery. He's at the hospital for special surgery this morning. <laughs> Gino, how you doing? I'm doing just great, Brian. Yeah? Yep. Talk, a, talk to us about what happened. It was uh, late at night. It was about 9, 9.30, very dark night, on a, on a wide boulevard that parallels the uh, Gulf of Mexico, called Gulf Boulevard. And I was walking across the street to, uh, to get my car, and, uh, and I ended up running across the street and not quite making it. And I got hit by the car, got thrown onto the sidewalk and onto the, onto the siding on the grass, and... Uh, my leg twisted around and it's broken in a number of places and they did a very good job of surgery here this morning and I'm all, I'm getting better. I'm getting better. Yeah, we talked yesterday. You told me you got a rod in that in that leg now and some screws in it yeah, too at the bottom? Yeah, yes, there's a steel uh, beam going right down from my knee, <laughs> right, right down to my ankle and the ankle was uh, smashed very well. So that was pulverized. So there's a little plate oh. in there and then there are screws on either side of my ankle. Hi, so, Gene. You look great, though. Oh, I, I really feel I really feel great. That's what the C is for, Katie. <laughs> the, the C is for crossing, collision, and compound. <laughs> is that a, is that a turn of the century Cubs hat? Is that what, sir? Is that a turn of the century Chicago Cubs hat? This is the turn of the century uh, Pittsburgh Crawford's hat from oh, okay. the old from the old Negro leagues. Yeah. I love this hat and I love those leagues. Hey, Gene, when are you going to be able to leave the hospital? I hope to leave the hospital early in a week <clears throat> on crutches and a. Uh, a viewer from the uh, from the Boo Boo Buddy store in Natick, Massachusetts, made this doll Aww. with uh, with crutches, glasses that look like mine, a mustache, a bow tie, and listen to this, real plastic <laughs> on the leg. Now you don't have your cast on yet. Um, you're going to get that sometime next week. And how long are you going to have to wear that thing? About six weeks. Six weeks on a cast, and then after that, split, and then the physical therapy to get this leg walking again and they figure that in six months I'll be able to put all of my body weight on this leg. Yeah. Boy, Gene, how are you going to be able to chase all the girls? It's going to be very hard. <laughs> Have you ever seen a guy limping after a pretty girl? Down the <laughs> I think we will. <laughs> hey, you it's, said that you might be able to have your doctor there. Is he there? No, the doctor is in surgery. This doctor every morning is cutting somebody up. I can hear the knife. <laughs> There's a guy who grinds knives in the hall just outside my door every morning. He's a very fine doctor, and uh, he did a really good job because it was a really complicated operation. Yeah. You getting everything you need over there? Can we get you anything? You got enough movies to watch? Uh, Jeffrey Lyons, the movie critic, sent me a note saying, you'll do anything to get out of watching Luck, Luck, Mighty Ducks 2. <laughs> <laughs> or Hot Sucker Proxy, yeah. <laughs> so, uh, I may go to Hollywood. Uh, maybe they'll make a, uh, a sequel to My Left Foot. I'm perfectly qualified for that. I'll tell you that. I'm ready. Hey, I'm Gino. Ready. All right, pal. Get some rest. Great to see Take you, Gene. Take it easy. Bye, Gene. Do what Good the doctor spirit. says, okay? See you back in the studio before long. All right. All right.